Welcome back to our Tech Tip series. In this episode, we'll be focusing on an essential component of your boat's comfort, the marine air conditioner. We'll show you how to maintain your marine air conditioner and keep it running smoothly. So, let's dive in. Air conditioning units on boats often go unnoticed until they stop working or cause damage. To avoid these issues, it's important to give them some attention and perform regular maintenance. Although we recommend having a professional inspect and service your air conditioner regularly, there are some basic maintenance tasks that you as a boat owner can do yourself. First, let's start by checking the raw water intake strainer. Inspect the strainer for any signs of damage, such as holes or corrosion. Remove any marine growth, large particles, or debris that may have accumulated. Additionally, Check the hoses connected to the strainer for any damage and ensure that the seawater hoses are double clamped. Don't forget to inspect the through hull, strainer basket, and valves for any obstructions that could impede the smooth flow of cooling water. And finally, visually confirm that there is good overboard water flow. Next, let's move on to cleaning the air filters and evaporator coils. Dirty and clogged filters can reduce the efficiency of your AC unit and even damage the system in extreme cases. Clean your air conditioner filters monthly by washing them with plain water, vacuuming, or blowing away the dirt. Allow the filters to dry thoroughly before reassembling them, as moist filters attract dust. While you're at it, check the evaporator as well. Make sure it's clean and that the fins are not damaged. Ensure that the intake airflow to the evaporator is not restricted by any equipment or items placed in front of it. Also, take the time to inspect the ducting and, if accessible, the condition of the blower motor. This prevents the accumulation of rust and other debris that can be blown out onto the boat's interior, potentially causing stains on fabric surfaces. Lastly, let's not forget about the condensate pan. Check the condensate pan for any signs of corrosion. If you notice any corrosion, it's crucial to repair or replace the pan to prevent leaking. Proper drainage is essential to avoid damage to the boat's interior wood or fabrics, so ensure that the water drains properly. And there you have it. By following these easy steps, you can effectively maintain your marine air conditioner and prevent potential damage to your boat. Remember, while you can handle basic maintenance, it's still highly recommended to have a professional inspect and service your air conditioning system regularly. Thanks again for watching. And please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips. Stay tuned for our next episode. And if you have any questions or would like to book a service, please visit our website at www.titanmarineair.com. Until next time, goodbye.